The GameCube is probably my favourite console of all time, and I thought it would be fun to make a video of some GameCube games I would love to see brought to the Switch at some point. This list does not include any Zelda games, as I would be a bit unfair with putting them on the list. Anyway, let's get into this list. First on the list we have Mario Party 4. Now, I played this game a lot growing up, especially playing it with my family, so I have a lot of memories with this particular Mario Party. And it has such a competitive nature about it, and it's always fun just to sit down and play some Mario Party from time to time. I'd love to see this on the Switch, whatever it be, on the Virtual Console or some sort of GameCube Classics Collection, which would also be pretty cool because you could get quite a lot of amazing games on there. This game holds a lot of childhood memories for me, and it would be so great to play it on the Switch again, and that's why it gets on this list. Next on the list we have Mario Kart Double Dash, and oh man, this game is one of my favourite games of all time. I cannot deny that, and the childhood memories created from this game does add to it, but Double Dash is one of my most memorable games I played growing up, and I still play it today because of how fun it is. Now, Mario Kart 8 is close to Double Dash, but Double Dash definitely gets my pick over Mario Kart 8. All the amazing courses in this game, and the fact that you could have any two characters together in the same cart was just so awesome. And Playing this with family again was really fun, and if you ever get the chance to play Mario Kart Double Dash, I definitely recommend it, as it's one amazing game in my opinion, and would be a great addition to the Switch library. Even just a digital download please, Nintendo. I really love Mario Kart Double Dash, and I think it would make a great addition to the Nintendo Switch library. Now, this next one is actually my favourite Super Mario game of all time. And that is Super Mario Sunshine. Oh man, this game is a game that definitely shaped me into the gamer I am today. I can't even think how many hours I have put into this game, and it was amazing. I was really young when I played Sunshine for the first time, so it probably was quite a lot of hours put into the game. But anyway, Mario Sunshine is one hell of an amazing game, and a game I think a lot of Nintendo fans can say is one of the best games ever made by Nintendo. As at the time of its release, it looked absolutely stunning in my opinion, and still holds up really well today. And all the different colourful and strange levels and areas all just made the game so amazing for me. One of my particular favourites is Rico Harbour, mainly because I got stuck on it quite a lot, and did not want to give up, so I kept at it. and finally completed whatever shine I was stuck on, and that's what really made me enjoy the game so much. I played the game at a very young age as I've already said, and it's no wonder it's my favourite Super Mario game of all time, due to all these amazing things. Also, I really loved the sort of secret Shadow Mario levels where you did not have Flood, and they were kinda like early Super Mario Galaxy looking levels, and man they were just amazing. This game takes me way back and I still love playing it today, it's just one amazing game that I think every Nintendo fan or even Mario fan should definitely play, it's one amazing game. So I know this list was a shorter list than usually, but my editing software is still a bit tricky to get around, so I'm still learning how to use it, and my editing on this new software is definitely improving, so sorry about that. But I want to know what GameCube games you would all have brought to the Switch if you could. And I also want to thank you all for helping reach 200 subscribers. Yes, that's right, we did it everyone. I will have more on the topic in the upcoming episode of the Skyward Study, which is coming soon. But I really do appreciate it a lot everyone, so thank you so much for that. So, until the next time, I've been Hyrule Gamer.